My name is Garrett, and in Milsim Paintball, camouflage is an important element. Now, today I'm going to show you how you can make a neck guard and a hood with just a simple shirt and two safety pins. So stay tuned. Like I said, in this video, we're going to work on making a camouflage hoodie that you can easily wear for any Milsim game that you plan on attending. In order to show you how this is done, I picked a different shirt that was a little bit easier to see. First thing we do is turn it inside out. Wherever the back label is, that'll actually be the front of the hood. First thing we do is take the sleeve and fold it over and what we're going to do is safety pin it to the collar. After that, we bring the other sleeve crossing over it and we safety pin that to the collar and through the other shirt. Next, we turn it right side out Now where the sleeves overlap on the collar, that is going to be the neck guard. That is going to be the front of the hood. Now here's a camo shirt that I had in storage that I plan on using to make the camo hood. It's made of a lightweight, breathable fabric. Obviously I have picked it up in China because there I'm in a triple extra large. You'll notice the fabric will stretch one direction but not so much the other. This is what makes this material great for making hoods. Okay. Like the other shirt, I just turned it inside out, making sure that, I, that the label of the shirt is going to be the front part of the hood. Just like I did before, I cross the sleeve over the collar and I'll cross the other sleeve over the collar as well. Now, I'm going to be sewing this one to make it more permanent. So in that case, I'm gonna be pinning these in place. These don't have to be pinned smoothly because this is going to be a rough job. This just needs to be put in place so that it doesn't pop off or lose some of the stitches during the game. Make sure you have your sewing machine settings fit for stretchable material. If you don't have a sewing machine, you can easily do just a couple stitches by hand. And there you go. With just a couple minutes time and a few items, you were able to make a camouflage hoodie that'd be great for a Milsim game. I hope you have a chance to make your own hoodie and I look forward to seeing it. If you have any questions on how I did this or have questions about some of your own projects for this, please let me know in the comments below. I hope you have a great day and I hope to see you out on the field. Talk to you then.